The Dramone Hydraulic Multilock Automatic Coupler for excavators and backhoes is designed with safety, reliability and durability in mind, where attachment changes are completed safely without leaving the cab. Constructed from high-strength steel and manufactured using world-class manufacturing facilities, this coupler is designed to last the test of time. Comprising multiple locking features, the coupler has operator safety in mind right throughout the system. Supplied with a control system, the Dramone Multilock Automatic Coupler is a world leader in coupler safety, surpassing all current standards and best practice. All locking devices are suitably color-coded, red to signify security with the engagement system, a distinct yellow color feature to bring attention to its movement. Both front and rear attachment pins are independently mechanically locked through the full working cycle and both are independently hydraulically released at the operator's station. With a universal attachment pickup range within excavator weight class, the Multilock Automatic Coupler will ensure that your current suite of attachments can be connected and operated from your excavator. To open the Drummond Multilock Automatic Coupler and deactivate the locks, set the boomstick in an over-vertical position. Fully crowd the bucket cylinder. Then using the in-cab control panel, initiate the opening sequence by first pressing power, then by pressing control. The audible and visual indicators will signify the activation of the opening sequence. Make sure to over-relieve the hydraulic pump by further crowding the main bucket cylinder lever. First, the rear primary lock will deactivate, then the engagement system will begin to retract. After the engagement system has cleared, the rear attachment pin will continue to open the front locking mechanism. The coupler is now ready to pick up the attachment. Engage the front jaw of the coupler with the front pin of the bucket. As the attachment pin engages with the front jaw of the coupler, the front instantly locks, eliminating pick and place of attachments. Continue to curl the bucket into crowd position. Press the power button on the in-cab control panel to switch off the control system. Add a little pressure by over-relieving the hydraulic pump. As the engagement system grips the rear bucket pin, the primary rear lock also engages the rear attachment pin. A view from the operator's position confirms the engagement system as well as the primary rear lock are in place. Proceed to curl out and confirm the front lock is also in situ. A final check can verify the bucket is securely in place by lightly striking the bucket on the ground as shown. Continue to rerun this simple sequence to pick up the next attachment, keeping your excavator working at what it does best, excavating.